गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस वन टॉपिक दैट इज़ फ्रॉम योर राइटिंग सेक्शन वी हैव लॉन्ग बीन लर्निंग डिफरेंट चैप्टर्स फ्रॉम योर इंग्लिश लिटरेचर एज वेल एज फ्रॉम ग्रामर पार्ट राइट बट टूडे थ्रू दिस पर्टिकुलर लाइव क्लास काइंड ऑफ लाइव क्लास आई एम गोइंग टू शेयर विथ यू हाउ टू राइट आर आई मीन समथिंग फ्रॉम योर राइटिंग सेक्शन एंड द मोस्ट इम्पॉर्टेंट थिंग फ्रॉम योर राइटिंग सेक्शन इज नान अदर दैन फॉर्मल लेटर right formal letter you people get very confused there are different sorts of formal letter so i am going to make you understand how to write formal letter okay first let me write down the topic let me write then i will discuss with you so here i am writing please write down the question as well because whatever i am writing you have to write in your fair copy of grammar because you have to make two copies copy number 1 for your literature books both the books copy number 2 for grammar part and also कंपोजिशन पार्ट राइटिंग इज अ पार्ट ऑफ कंपोजिशन तो इसी चीज को कहाँ पे लिखना होगा जो ग्रामर वाली कॉपी है उसमें ही कंपोजिशन पार्ट एक डिवीजन बना के रखना तो राइट डाउन इन द सेकेंड पार्ट दैट इज फॉर कंपोजिशन ओके लेट मी राइट डाउन राइट एंड एप्लीकेशन यू नो फॉर्मल लेटर इज कॉल्ड एप्लीकेशन राइट एंड एप्लीकेशन टू द एडिटर T O R carefully E D I T O R संपादक हिंदी में बोलते हैं इन्हें राइट टू द एडिटर ऑफ अ न्यूज पेपर ऑफ ए न्यूज पेपर नाउ डिस्क्राइबिंग यू हैव टू डिस्क्राइब राइट राइट एन एप्लीकेशन टू द एडिटर ऑफ अ न्यूज पेपर डिस्क्राइबिंग हाउ द पीपल सफर हाउ द पीपल सफर भू करते हैं राइट right? suffer due to irregular water service so in big cities and also in villages water is supplied right it is supplied from the municipality in big cities and from panchayat and some other organizations it is supplied in the rural areas and suburban areas okay so if the water supply is irregular definitely especially at the time of summer people will suffer a lot unko agar pani nahi milega to kaise kaam karenge kaise bartan donge kaise पियेंगे राइट सो इट्स अ मैटर ऑफ ग्रेव कंसर्न सो साफर ड्यू टू इरेगुलर वाटर सप्लाई इट इज अ क्वेश्चन सो इट इज अ फॉर्मल लेटर बिकॉज यू आर गोइंग टू राइट द लेटर टू द एडिटर ऑफ द न्यूज पेपर सो फर्स्ट दे इज अ स्ट्रक्चर राइट प्लीज कीप इट इन योर माइंड दे इज अ स्ट्रक्चर पहले क्या लिखते हैं जो चिट्ठी लिखता है जो एप्लीकेशन लिखता है उसका खुद का एड्रेस एट द टॉप ऑन द लेफ्ट हैंड साइड दो लाइन से ज्यादा नहीं होना चाहिए उसके नीचे क्या लिखते हैं आज की डेट लिख देंगे क्लियर सो फर्स्ट राइट एन इमेजिनरी एड्रेस यू मे राइट वॉट एवर यू वॉन्ट बट इट शुड नॉट बी मोर देन टू लाइन ओके सो हियर आई एम स्टार्टिंग इट इज अ क्वेश्चन सो फ्रॉम हियर आई एम गोइंग टू स्टार्ट राइटिंग द आंसर ओके राइट डाउन योर एड्रेस बिकॉज यू आर राइटिंग द लेटर राइट डाउन नाइनटीन स्टेशन रोड Here I am writing answer because this thing you have to write. So left hand side पे इसे लिखना है 19 Station Road, Seeker, comma Rajasthan. That's it. Don't write more than this. Okay. On the left hand side you are writing your own address. Think it is your own address. Then don't leave any line or don't leave any space. Write down today's date. So today's date is 20. 05 2020. Okay, तो इसे डाल दी इसके बाद क्या करना है एक लाइन छोड़नी है यू हैव टू लीव वन लाइन एंड आफ्टर दैट यू हैव टू राइट टू होम यू आर राइटिंग द लेटर तो ये एप्लीकेशन हम किसको लिख रहे हैं जो एडिटर है जो संपादक महाशय है तो यू हैव टू राइट ओके सो लीव वन लाइन एंड राइट डाउन द टी कैपिटल एच स्मॉल ई स्मॉल देन स्पेस देन एडिटर E capital D I T O R. Write down the name of the newspaper. It may be anything. Write down preferably the name of uh, an English newspaper, Times of India. Okay. So the Times of India. Okay. And write down Jaipur. That's it. Means here you are writing the letter to the editor. So one line. छोड़ने के बाद उनका designation क्या है? और न्यूज़पेपर का नाम क्या है 
and the name of the city from where the newspaper gets published. It is done. After that, you have to write subject. Leave one line, one line, chhod dete ya space chhodte hain. And after that, write down subject. Write like this: S U B. Okay, S U B. Subject likh dete hain. And write down the subject. After this, you may draw a line as well using scale because it will look very good if you draw the line using a scale. You may write irregular water service, your irregular water supply, whatever you want. I wrote like this: what water supply is irregular because that is the main point. So here you have written the subject. It is compulsory for formal letter because the person you are writing the letter to, he or she may not be very, uh, I mean, free. So if the person looks at this subject, then will be able to understand that its subject matter is what. Read it. Understand? Clear? So you have to write subject water supply is irregular or irregular water uh, supply. Then after that you have to started writing respected ma'am oblique sir. Okay, now it is in modern way of writing. The receiver's address is also being written. मतलब इसके नीचे date के नीचे receiver का जो address है उसे भी लिखा जा रहा है but here you need not write this because it is very much I mean strange type of writing if you write down the receiver's address. I am not going to include but in few books you may find this. Okay. Now after this, I am writing respected ma'am or sir. First, write because ladies first. This thing respected ma'am or sir. After that, you have to write this. After that, you have to write this from here. Clear? You may not be able to see. That's why I am writing again respected ma'am sir. Okay. Write like this because you don't know whether the uh editor is a man or a lady after that you have to write but there is no space okay that's why i am going to erase this part and i am going to write this so you have already observed properly pehle kya likh rahe hain jo chithi likh raha hai uska khud ka address do line se zyada bada nahi hona chahiye to jis din likh raha hai to us din ki date space chhod dete hain the editor the times of india newspaper ka naam uske baad jahan se publish hota hai to ek line chhod ke subject Irregular water supply service or water supply is irregular. Then respected ma'am sir. Up to this, it is a kind of structure you know very well. After that, I am going to erase this and I am going to write the main body of the letter because first I decided I will write here. Then I thought that you will get confused. That's why I am just going to. So here you should write. I am writing here. Iske niche likhna hai. I am writing here. Okay. Write down I, comma. I then comma write your full name if you want. I am writing an imaginary name Santosh Kumar Ahuja. I comma Santosh Kumar Ahuja, a resident R E S I D E N T, जो रह रहा है right a resident from Seeker is capital letter. Would no comma no comma need to be put it need to be put right. Resident from seeker would like to draw your kind attention, dhyan regarding the matter that. Water supply, water supply has become very irregular in few places and colonies. C O L O N Y. प्लूरल नंबर के लिए क्या बनता है ये आई एस फुल स्टॉप ड्यूरिंग स्कॉचिंग तो इट इज एस सी ओ आर सी एच आई एन जी ड्यूरिंग स्कॉचिंग ओके स्कॉचिंग दिस वर्ड वी यूज फॉर समर ड्यूरिंग स्कॉचिंग हीट कॉमा इफ वाटर शॉर्टेज 
persists rehena kind of remain water shortage persists comma it creates huge problem it creates huge problem with the residents the timings plural number bahut sare time hote hain that's why i wrote plural number the timings of water supply the timings of water supply are not fixed sometimes the flow of water pani ki jo gati hoti hai the flow or you may write pace p a c e pace and flow they are synonyms the flow of water is extremely we face write down we have been facing present perfect continuous pehle se pehle bhi face kar rahe the abhi bhi kar rahe hain aur shayad future mein bhi karte rahenge to face karte ja rahe hain present perfect continuous we have been facing water crisis संकट पानी का संकट राइट वाटर क्राइसिस सिंस लास्ट मार्च सो हियर इन द फर्स्ट पैराग्राफ ऑलरेडी यू मेंशन अबाउट द प्रॉब्लम्स दैट यू आर फेसिंग इन द सेकेंड पैराग्राफ यू हैव टू सीक फॉर अ फ्यू सोल्यूशन ऑलरेडी यू टॉक्ट अबाउट द प्रॉब्लम्स तो अगले पैराग्राफ में हम क्या मांगेंगे सोल्यूशन मांगेंगे हाउ बिकॉज वाट इज द एक्चुअल रिस्पॉन्सिबिलिटी ऑफ द एडिटर ही विल पब्लिश द न्यूज और ही विल गेट द न्यूज पब्लिश्ड and now the people who are associated with the municipality will understand that the people at that particular area are suffering from water shortage that point of time they will resume the service unke paas ye khabar pahunch jayegi to pahunchte hi ve pani ki jo supply aur bhi behtar tarike mein karne ki koshish karne lag jayenge that is the solution right so after the first paragraph again i have to and second paragraph we have to start from the middle of the page so kaise likh sakte hain therefore hindi mein arthat therefore i request you therefore i request you request to you is wrong request ke baad pronoun se pehle ya koi noun lete hain uske pehle to galat hota hai okay I request you everything for each and everything in English. There is a rule. Therefore, I request you to look into the matter. Look into what is the meaning? Investigate, जांच करना, right? To look into एक साथ लिखना है. Look into the matter as soon as possible. therefore i request you to look into the matter as soon as possible full stop and last sentence you are writing i shall be highly i shall be highly obliged o b l i g d hindi mein aabhar kritagya dhanya okay so i shall be highly obliged after that i have to write again because if i write here you will be unable to see to meri writing dikhegi nahi so after this i am going to erase two three lines and i am going to write the next part okay so now i am going to write the next part i shall be highly obliged uske baad obliged ke baad if you kindly allow i shall be highly obliged if you kindly give us a quick solution a likha hai to solution likhna hai solutions nahi hai if you kindly give us a quick solution 
by getting this by getting this letter published okay to is letter ko publish karwate hue by getting this letter published in your in your kahan pe newspaper mein so another word is daily news daily you know very well so in your reputed means famous reputed news daily you may give a dash if you want reputed news daily the letter or application is complete after that leave some space after that leave some space iske niche kya likhna hai thanking you right space chhod dete hain uske niche t capital thanking you don't write thank you it's a way of writing thanking you then don't leave any space yours y o u r s there should not be any apostrophe again i am telling yours y capital o u r s there should not be any apostrophe apostrophe bilkul nahi honi chahiye yours sincerely or you may write faithfully though i do not like this word but i think somehow the best word is sincerely your sincerely and after that write your name already i wrote the name santosh kumar ahuja right so space nahi chhodni hai don't leave any space and write down thanking you your sincerely on the left left hand side you have to write don't write at the middle kahan pe likhna hai ise left hand side pe hi likhna hai theek hai your sincerely faithfully don't write that is santosh s capital santosh kumar k capital santosh kumar and i wrote ahuja so a capital so here you wrote your name and after that give your signature okay you may not write this but i think it looks better if you write your signature because here you are not sending an email you are sending a letter by writing with a pen on a paper right so you may write like this as well so here the letter is complete 